journey will come to an end, one way or another. No fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. Tis not our place to hurry the arisen. Pickens of late, and I do in my touch. I feel a sight better once I've had my dinner. Peril Wickedness has no hold on the things I can't seem to find. Did you need something, dear?
must fetch those papers. Sir, are you the Arisen? I? Then you must have been to the Argaman ruins. I heard a rumor that a Medusa was seen there. Is it true? Because if so, that means tis no mere creature of legend, but a monster as real as any other. Know you the legend of the hero Danaus? Well, one version of the tale claims the hero's foe was a Medusa. The legend is inscribed here. You must take it and read it for yourself, sir, seeing as you've witnessed the genuine article. new recruits battle ready yet. You shall answer.
ruins your day, like getting cut open. <laughs> Such worn out gear. If that is your destination, we cannot follow. But know that your return is eagerly awaited. No, oh, no, this is all wrong. What use of pitiful fragments such as these? But what we have achieved is sufficient to sway the pawns. But when the time comes to fell the dragon, I fear it may not be enough. Lord Phasus insists we shall succeed, and yet... Ah, a new hand, are you? Have you some business with me? Why? 
Tis an arisen's. This... This is incredible. I've never seen such a luster. But why do you possess such a thing? Where did you obtain it? No. Never mind. Tis of no consequence. All that matters is this. With this alone, I shall be able to craft a superior godsway, the finest of all created to date. I must make haste that I might deliver it to Lord Phasus even a moment sooner. But wait, no. I have not the worms-like crystals to restore it. Concern it all! You've not heard of them. They are formed of crystallized drops of dragon blood, and each fragment contains a portion of the beast's soul. It is a requisite component of the god sway, which is formed when the souls of Arisen and Dragon are combined. Naturally, such crystals can only be obtained through the slaying of drakes and their ilk. Yet I am doubtful that Lord Phasus would lend me his forces when the ritual is so close. We've few enough hands as tears. Ha <laughs> oh, don't be ridiculous. Do you even understand what you're offering? Worm's life crystals can only be obtained from drakes. But I suppose I am in no position to decline, even if tis a fool's errand. Lord Phasus is satisfied with the god's way as tis, you see. And as I can expect no support from him, you can expect little aid from me. Though, I suppose twouldn't do to send you away entirely empty-handed. Feel free to take what you require from the laboratory. Now, as I've said, Worm's Life Crystals can only be obtained from drakes and their ilk. Seek one out and fell it, if tis within your power. All the better if it happens to be a lesser dragon. You would be solving two of my problems, then. Well met, Sir Arisen. Let us dispense with pleasantries and cut to the heart of the matter. I have a task that requires someone of your skill and discretion. Some days ago, a fiend attacked Empress Nadinya during her supplications. Her Majesty was unharmed, but the would-be assassin fled, gifting me a wounded arm in the process. He may seek to strike again, yet I fear I am not fit to guard the Empress as I am. And so I turn to you, Sir Arisen. Will you catch this villain in my stead? My deepest thanks. Her Majesty will next begin her supplications in Flamebearer Palace. I would use this opportunity to lure her assassin from the shadows. Empress Nadinia's life is in your hands, Sir Arisen. I trust you understand the gravity of this task. their costs. Really now, you mustn't shirk your duty, lest you- It's my duty to hear the people's concerns. Do you know how long you'll be? I only asked so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my... Hmm. And who might? Sir Arisen. You've come just in time. Sir Armhild, tis my pleasure to present to you the good Arisen. Come to aid us in apprehending the brigand who would threaten Her Majesty's life. Well met. Your assistance is most welcome. Without our Empress to guide us, Batal has no future. Her Majesty cannot be allowed to come to harm. Indeed. We are well glad of your aid. May it prove unnecessary. Ere Her Majesty's supplications begin, I shall give you a description of our target. Pray seize the rogue should you espy him. We would, however, prefer that this affair be kept quiet. Be not reckless in your decision, lest you apprehend the innocent. 
Empress Nadinia shall commence her prayers any moment now. I would ask that you safeguard her with your life, should it come to that. O oh, Lambent Flame, we offer thee these words of prayer on behalf of our people. Mayhap if I hang about, someone will buy alt. Got to order in we ask that all be spared the horrors of the fell dragon. We ask that Batal may e'er prosper. And we ask that a day may come when Beastron, Human, Horn, and every other noble race that walks our world may live in harmony with one another. Let me... Sir Arisen, Her Majesty's supplications are nearing their end. Have you located the rogue? Seize the rogue the moment you espy him. I shall pray for your success. It would be no boast to say I have a real eye for color. May thine hallowed fire burn through us and cleanse our souls of all that is base and wicked. We swear fealty unto thee, originator of warmth, prosperity, and shelter, and ask naught but thy blessing in return for our devotion. Her Majesty's supplications are drawing to a close, Sir Arisen. Could it be that the rogue has not come? None of these milk sops are worth my time. Hasn't anyone got coin to spend? Oh, it's changed at sea. I feel it in my bones. What's your problem? Who are ye supposed to be? Fie! Are they on to me? Ah, oh, shot it! Apprehend him at once! That man there is the assassin! <laughs> Nicely done, Sir Arisen. Let us inform Sir Ermhild of what has transpired. Oh, Your Majesty. Full glad am I to see you unharmed. The brigand has been captured. The chaos of the past few days ought to be behind us now. We owe this outcome to you, Sir Arisen. You cannot know the depth of my gratitude. Ah, yes, of course. Batal is in your debt, Sir Arisen. The same is true of you, Sir Manella. Your efforts were most admirable, considering your wound. Now that a measure of peace is returned to us, however, you ought to devote yourself to convalescence for a time. You may. The curative hot springs on Volcanic Island are said to be wondrous for healing. Go there to recuperate. Very well, my lady. I shall leave presently, and return when I am fully recovered. Grateful are we for your most valiant efforts, Sir Arisen.
We would not make a hasty judgment. Grateful are we for your most... I have been waiting for you, Arisen. That was well fought. There's no one standing in my side. No doubt this triumph will spur us to the next. Flee! Your lives are in jeopardy. You've been warned. I shall be responsible for your lives if you decide not to listen. Let's finish this. 
are none of us alike in vocation. It is a tad inconvenient that we can't share equipment. Let us utilize our individual strengths wherever possible. I believe this is intended as a means of transport. It would be interesting to see where it might take us. Contraptions like these are best used when and as we find them. I be of assistance. to return. One can see well into the distance from here. What 
that our strengths might be restored simply by gazing upon the site. Shall I assist? such tranquility can last. I suppose it is so? to retreat then where you do not fall prey to the enemy's attack as we pass I quite agree gathering materials makes for dull work indeed no sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand the early griffin gets the world. Feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Off we go then. Feeling rested, I trust. I see a ladder yonder, but we can't need the finding of equipment enhancing materials to me, Master. I shall sniff them out and mark them on your map. I can't imagine we're in need of a campsite just now. It is well to be prepared, but over preparation will serve us not. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our way. Try not to get hit, lest all that vim goes to waste. Ice's sting is yours to wield! <laughs> that 
Lily. I did not know I could feel so alive. You've returned. Have you obtained any Worm's Life crystals? You have? Incredible! That is no small feat. I must admit, I had not thought you much chance of success. Yet here you are, and this this is precisely what I require to complete my work. I shan't delay. 
Come by again tomorrow. By then, I will have produced a god's way of unparalleled quality. you'll be? I only ask so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my strength. It is not our place to hurry the Arisen. Oh, it is finished. The result is even more sublime than I'd hoped. I must deliver it to Lord Phasus at once. Though, mayhap. Now, I cannot leave this in your hands. I may not be fleet of foot, but only I can do this. changed my mind. You take it. Deliver the blade to Lord Faces. You won't reach him in time. Go now. Make haste for Moonglint Tower. There your journey will come to an end. One way or another. Good, you return. I find myself on edge when you stray from my line of sight. <laughs> <laughs> 